Well, hello, hello there, dear folks and fellow YouTubers. I am Nuclear Scality7, and in one of today's videos, I'll be doing part six of my Serious Sam First Encounter HD walkthrough. I'm gonna go ahead and press any key to start to find out what's the name of the level we're on today. And today we're on, I believe, the Dunes level. We'll find it out. Yes, I was right. Dunes, with all four elements in hand, I feel very confident in our mission success. Now we are approaching Memphis. It should be over that hill before us. I am reasonably confident that we will find some answers there. Do not expect an easy entrance. Memphis, Memphis is probably heavily guarded. Can't talk for some reason. Here comes trouble. Here comes trouble. Now I'm going to be careful because I'm playing on a fairly tough difficulty. Luckily, I don't think it's going to be as tough as I initially thought it was. No, in the, my last video for this game before this one, I apologize if I got frustrated and annoyed at how hard the game was. You guys watching this had absolutely nothing to do with it. I was frustrated at myself. For example, when I said, no getting killed, I said that to myself, not to you guys. But still, I apologize if I came across in a rude, curt, or unfair way. It was absolutely not intentional, but still, I apologize nonetheless if I came across this in a Hey, we YouTubers are human. Just like everybody. Ooh. I'm a meager mortal like you guys watching this. Of course. Stating my common humanity like you guys. And I think I was also just a little tired and a little cranky for whatever reason when I made that video. Because, hey, I might not have slept very well before I made that video. And, among other things. Oh, Kamikaze Marines. Gotta blow them to Kingdom Come, of course. Ah, blood on Sahara Desert City. That's kind of an unsettling thought, if you ask me, because you think of deserts, especially the Sahara Desert in Africa, so kind of clean and almost pristine. I mean, it can depend on what part of the Sahara Desert you are. Say so I got killed there, but luckily it auto-saved for me. It was kind enough to auto-save for me. Yeah. I promise you, regardless of how frustrated I get with the difficulty in certain areas of this game, I'm not going to lose my temper like I did that one. I'm going to go ahead and save, just so there's no chance I'll have to start the whole thing all over again. Kamikaze Marines, what do you know? Now, a little interesting, obvious fact about these enemies is that they're named after the Kamikaze pilots in from Japan during World War II, one of the Axis powers. Not again! Okay, I'm just gonna use maybe a rocket launcher to take them out. Maybe I'll take them out more swiftly, quickly. Possibly, because yeah, they can just kind of come out of nowhere. At least that's what I think. A little lesson, I guess, in anger management, those difficult parts, at least when it comes to video games. I'm just making sure that them just sneak up on me without my realizing it. I'm gonna be a little more mindful of how I look up for them. Yeah. Yeah, and I'm clearly in a much better mood the last time I made a video for this. So, yeah. Again, though, I admittedly wish that there was a way to lower the difficulty, but it looks like at least once you've selected a difficulty, you can't change that so far. Got an idea, maybe I'll go over here. So yeah, just the enemies kind of group up on you when you try to go there. That's why I'm going in this direction, because yeah, they just really kind of 
gain up on you after a certain specific point, so I'm still here. So yeah. Save. All right. <clears throat> There's some health plus what appears to be mega armor. Oops, that was dumb. When the music turns on. That means enemies are coming your way, so you gotta watch out for that. Luckily, there's only one enemy, which is that clear over there. At least from the looks of it. Oh, watch out. Ah, finally, some mega health. I was really needing that. Plus ammunition for my minigun and Tommy gun. I'm gonna go ahead and save. Just so there's no risk that I'll have to start that part all over again. Because, yeah, I'll send it four enemies after, of course. Yeah, awesome. Oh yeah. There we go. Ugh. As I said a bit earlier in this video, I'm clearly in a much better mood than I was when I made the last video for this game before this one. I don't know why, I'm just in a much better mood, so... I guess the music maybe in this game is cheering me up a little bit. Or something. Soaking up the desert with the blood of the kamikaze birds as I blow them up one by one. Yeah! That's what the doctor wanted. I think we've appeared to have cleared up this area of enemies here. Okay, I'm just gonna go grab that backpack here. Or so I thought. I guess not. I guess that's wrong. Okay. Again, don't forget we YouTubers are human no matter how big or small the channel is. Just like you guys watching the video. I'm just gonna save quickly in case I'm killed. At least that way I won't have to start this segment of the game over again. Alright. We're gonna be dead before we know it. Die. Yeah. Okay. Notice how I tend to avoid things they send at me by doing that. Excellent. <clears throat> okay, and I'm just gonna use a simple rocket launcher to take out this biomechanism. Voila, he's dead as a door now. Just gonna go grab that little health potion over there, and then I'm gonna go inside that Egyptian palace. 
And voila, we're gonna be met with a new kind of weapon in the game. Analyzing. XL2 laser gun, XL2 laser gun. Weapon, XL2 laser gun, ammo, X7 power cells, RO rate of fire, 600 rounds per minute, weight 20 pounds. Description, this weapon is still an experimental phase, but so far has proved to be very reliable. Four barrels fire in succession, allowing the weapon to deliver slow light energy pulses with extremely high rate of fire for a long period of time without overheating. Made entirely of titanium, it is both very light and immune to usual overheating problems, which makes it an excellent energy weapon. Notes, useful for covering large areas and holding enemy masses away. Okay, and I've already got enough ammo that I can go ahead and use it on the enemies I want to kill them here. Right, let's kill them. As that Metallica song would say, kill them all. I love it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, awesome. Take him out. Excellent. Oh, yeah. Man, I don't know why. I'm feeling pretty happy for some reason. Guess just playing this cheers me up. Excellent. <clears throat> you alive there, boy? Certainly you are. I don't appreciate that, boy. Finally, you're dead. It makes life easier. Blasted him to games. Yeah! <clears throat> only one more enemy to take out, but don't take my word for it, because knowing how I was wrong the last time. And I was wrong yet again. But hey, again, I'm just human like you guys watching this. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. Excellent. Die, monster. I'm gonna go ahead and save in case I'm killed, so at least I don't have to, again, start this part all over again. All right. Huh. I was gonna say, that seems a bit early to be done at this point. Die, sucker. Yeah, come on, boy. Die. Yeah. Oh, let's get behind something. 
Whoa, yeah. Whoa. Getting health plus save. I think it's a wise idea. At least that way, if you're killed, you don't have to start the game all over again. At least it's part of the game, I should say. Yeah. I said he's dead, I'm dead. My bad. Well, what do you know? That's the end of this part of the level. Awesome. Ah. <sighs> awesome. Oh, this game has secrets just like Doom does. But I'm just doing a... Sort of like my Hellbound walkthrough. I'm just doing a sort of basic idea of what you need to do to get to certain areas. Although I did discover 12 out of 38 secrets, so not bad considering how, I don't know these love games as level secrets as well as I do Doom 2 Hell on Earth. But still, yeah. Again, unlike Doom 2 Hell on Earth, this isn't like a 100% walkthrough where you do 100% kills, 100% items, 100% secret areas. <clears throat> Those things. But yeah, Still, I'm hoping this is still as such educational for you guys. But yeah, I'm surprised that that wasn't as challenging as it could have been. I guess partly I'm just not as tired making this video as I was, in the, as I said before, in the last one, before this one. But yeah. But I had way too much fun, to be honest, making this level. It was just, I felt so happy. I guess it was a combination of the music and just being in a just better mood altogether somehow. But anyhow, I believe that will end the video here folks and remember if you like my video please hit the like button below and if you want to see more of my videos please hit that subscribe button below and i will see you all when i see you all in the next video folks until then though stay safe happy and healthy in this period of pandemic and more importantly take care everybody as big mac davis would say goodbye for now and have a wonderful rest of your day amen